from So What's Next. Um, so as I mentioned in my first video, I'm working on the By Hand London ruffle skirt, the self-drafted uh, ruffle skirt. Unfortunately, you have to do a little bit of math. The skirt is a half circle cut to your waist measurement plus one half, so the wrap can overlap. It's a little bit tricky, so they give you this handy dandy worksheet. So this is the part where I actually cut out the skirt. It's a half circle. I had to do mine in two pieces, so I had to sew a center back seam. Um, so I got that all squared away, made my half circle skirt fine. Then I went to do the frill on the bottom and just gathered up the frill. And you're about to see, I attached it to the skirt and then made a little bit of an error. So I've made a little bit of a mistake. Um, so I'll try and back up and show you. So. Um, I, I don't have the waistband on yet, and I just put the ruffle on, and I wanted to uh, show you if you can see, let me just tilt the camera down, what I did. So I had to piece together my ruffle, and I surged it on the edge right here. And unfortunately, I put it on the wrong side, so now I'm gonna have to go back and fix that. Um, I guess just pick it out and reverse the seam. So we'll see what happens with that. Okay, so I fixed a little mistake and now um, I had the ruffles just basted onto my skirt. And now I'm just sewing those on completely. Um, and I made another little mistake um, and got the skirt caught up in the gather. So I had to start that over again, as you can see. Okay, so here I am at the end of that. This It's very long and tedious to sew all this skirt, but it looks great. So now that I've got the gathers all together, do I run this through my serger? All right, time to give this seam a quick press before I head to the serger. Here is the finished serge seam. So does anyone else have this problem? I'm sewing my hem, I've done a double fold, and then there's like a ripple all the way throughout my hem and it causes my hem to be, uh, look like it's being rolled. Anyway. So at this point, what you don't see is that I finished the hem and then I went and attached the waistband. First, I actually did some fusible interfacing, a lightweight fusible on the waistband because I didn't want it, it's a flimsy material, so I didn't want it to roll when I sit down. Um, so I did that and did the facings on the corner, the corners of the ties, um, and attached it right to the skirt, which is a pretty simple process, so no big deal there. And now you can see the final product. I will say this pattern was ex especially challenging for me. Um, I made quite a few mistakes and it's not something, you know, as a sewist, we always want to have perfect bakes, makes, but um, this one was definitely a challenge, but I am happy with how it turned out. So here it is.